Hello everybody and welcome back to another Fear the Walking Dead episode. This is season 5, episode 3. I'm not gonna know how to pronounce this. Humbug's Gulch. They make it look so easy, killing zombies and shit. Well, they've been doing this for so long, but still. Well, the sooner we can tie a bow around this, the sooner we can figure out where to head in. Then we find out. We get the yeah, something's gonna happen to John and June. Oh no, here it is. Here it is. Oh, cute. What? Is that some store? Oh, luck just turned again. Yeah, probably it's like a store where they sell. Guns and bullets and shit. Okay, not a store. At the whole town. <laughs> there was a brothel? There's some soup, that's all. Right? <laughs> oh my god, we haven't had a sex scene in Fear the Walking Dead in a while. I feel it's getting closer and closer, that sex scene. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I wouldn't change it. Are this a drug speaking again? How bad can it be? Why is Lucy so nice? Was she always this nice? Not at the beginning, right? <laughs> Whoa. We can make it. I think I will stay in this town. No, it's midnight. No treat to breathe. Tell my people like, hey, come here, I found a cool town. Oh, you were a geek, John. But we can't make it. No, chill. Just wait it out. Uh, there's something fishy here about this town and John. I feel it. Maybe he remembers something. Maybe something. Oh, see? Great. No, we can make it. <laughs> You wanted to make it to the car. You did. This is definitely like a roleplay episode. Where is she? Oh my god. I don't know who you mean. Tell me. Well, I'll put a You just broke your car, Dwight. What the fuck? That's a hell of a burn. Mm hmm. You think you had that before? Maybe you just mistook us for them? I may not believe it. No, but honey. It's <laughs> back at the. Oh my god, poor Lucy. Oh. What the hell was that? She's never gonna heal like this. You should be. Oh my god, they're getting into a war zone and they're not looking at the road to see if there are things. Mm. We used to do this back in 2014 in the protests. Someone doesn't want us here. I still, to this day, I don't drive, but if I'm with someone that's driving, I'll be looking at the floor, looking for those things. Still. I don't want to wait until it's too late again. Okay. She can't. She's hurt. Take it. Get out of here. No, you're coming no. with us, babe. You're coming with us. Mm -hmm. I came with both of you. I put a gun to your head. It's true. But we're not Rick. <laughs> as dear to you as this woman is to me. <sighs> she felt awkward. I shot a man's finger off because I thought he knew what had happened to her. Well, but Dwight. <laughs> and I'm not, I'm not trying to Dwight's been to married to this woman or been with this woman for longer than Dory with you. And then we're gonna help Are we still life. talking about this seriously? Like, move. I'm John. John Dory. <laughs> it's like the fish. <laughs> like the music. Yeah, that roof doesn't. No, come on. It. Uh -huh. Oh, Dwight, Dwight, stop moving. You're going to hold us off. Oh, crazy motherfucker. Oh, come on, Dwight. 
Couldn't he just look down to see if the... Get to the car! I got you. Why is he always so suicidal? I know you're not with your wife, but... God damn it, Dwight! What'd you call him? Walkers. Dead? We gotta move. Yes, now we have the Walker name here. Yes, yes, yes. You good? Ah, shot me, remember? <laughs> well, you shot us. He's been such a pussy. Look at Lucy. She's like, I'm good, I'm okay, I wouldn't change a thing. And Dwight's here like, oh, you shot me. Why is she playing fucking games though? Leaving notes and like running away. Stop running, let right, you your man me. find you. Or die. Take off the walk. Right. It was at a campground. <gasps> oh shit. Oh shit. Where did you find the car? Tell me. Was she there? I did, um. Thanks. Yeah. We all have. Yeah, we all have. not the same, baby. Just because I thought you had maybe done something to her. Nobody well, that's did. a good reason to kill them. There wasn't even anything for me in here to find. I ran when I met John because I didn't think I deserved what we had. This is different. Goosebumps. There's no difference. Come on, Dwight. Uh-huh. Uh -huh. Let me hug you, please. Anything? <laughs> the no <nose> stick. <laughs> I lost my mom. And my brother. And my boyfriend. And my stepdad. And my life. Oh, are you kidding me? Okay. Now keep running. I got one left. Can we just remember Lucy's wound and That's compare enough. it to Dwight's wound? Raise the axe! Raise the goddamn axe. Jesus Christ, John! That was so hot! <laughs> yeah! Six Gun Sam. That's what I went by when I occasionally took part in this yet. <laughs> Role playing Dory. <laughs> I did say it was hot. <laughs> I think she thinks so too. Yes! Give it to me! There are a union! Hey. Yeah, there's about three dozen dead past laying in the dirt who can bear witness. Yes, motherfuckers! Yes, motherfuckers! Yes, motherfuckers! Dwight? You two know each other? No. <laughs> Back you don't have to say it. We don't Not care. We don't care anymore. For you. That was so good, okay? Sure. I'm starting to feel like we're on the right track. No, I feel like this is a trap. What's that? Oh That's no. The, the kids were driving. Oh no. No. Oh no. Dylan, what happened? It's a fucking trap. I feel it. Think you bought it? Definitely. Uh, Dylan might crack. Are they really the ones doing this? Or was it... <sighs> Who are these kids and why don't they want any help? Like... Alicia is being so nice, offering help. If I, if I was them, I would want to join a group, a group of people where I can feel safe again. They're just three kids against the world. 
as far as we know. So I don't, I really don't get it. I don't get it. Why are they assholes? Because, my dear innocent Sora from the past, kids in The Walking Dead are assholes. The world made them like that. This walker world, but anyways, thank you for watching this episode with me, and as always, I'm Saramiano, and I'll see you in my next video. I am Peter Pan, I'll never be a man If you never wanna grow, take my hand I'll take you to Neverland